All right, we should be on. Spirit, all right, giving all praises on and glory to Yahweh by Shem, Yahweh Shai by Shem, Makakodash, the bonus to the apostles, the elders of Great Millstone, shout out to the elect, all right, and um, basically through the Spirit, we're just going to do a various topics, all right, we didn't have a, a particular set uh, topic in mind, we're just going to flow in the Spirit, all right, as y'all, if you don't, if you don't know, all right, it's, it's the year, the year of Karagma, all right, 2019. And uh, hey, it's a lot of things popping off, man. That's right. All right, this this month alone, it's uh, been a lot of action-packed events. All right, and it's a lot of action-packed events to come. All right, they got the Super Blood Wolf Moon. I think on the uh, twenty, what was that? The twentieth, the twenty-first. Mm -hmm. yeah. You know, uh, I think uh, I want to say Saturday. I think you got the partial solar eclipse. All right, it's going to hit certain parts of the world, man. You know, it's a lot of events popping off, man. All right, so it would uh, behoove you, all right, to get in the spirit of Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shah, man. All right, and gird up and get ready for these times, man. All right, uh, did anybody have something? Yeah, I got some real quick. Go ahead. Right. Prophecy. This is uh, 2 Ezra 15 and 1. Mm -hmm. Behold, speak thou in the ears of my people the words of prophecy. Right, and that's what we're doing, man. We're speaking into the ears of our people, all right, which is you Israelites, all right, the words of prophecy, all right, which are what? Which are contained in this Bible, man. All right, and the prophecies of what? Events that were foretold, all right, in the times of old, all right, to, to come to pass at a later time, man. Mm -hmm. All right, we're living in these times now. Go ahead. Which I will put in thy mouth. Right. Most I put these uh, words in our mouth, man. Go ahead. Save the Lord mm -hmm. and cause them to be written in paper. That's right. That's why we have the Holy Scriptures, man. All right. The prophets of old had these visions and, and dreams and, and, and certain uh, uh, things come from the Lord, man. They put them, put them down on paper, man. Go ahead. Come. <clears throat> it says, uh, for they are faithful and true. Mm -hmm. Go ahead. For all the unfaithful shall die in their unfaithfulness. That's right. And you know, hey, hey, man, at the end of the day, this truth is only for the elect, man. All right, Romans 13th chapter. Surely the election have obtained it, all right, but the rest were blinded, man. Mm -hmm. All right, so all the ones that don't believe, all right, don't don't have the uh, the faith in Yahweh by Shem Yahweh Shah, mm -hmm. hey, you're going to be judged, man. That's right. Go ahead. So like, yeah, I skipped over a verse. Okay, so go ahead. That was my bad. Okay, go ahead. Go Pardon ahead. me. Yeah, this is verse 3. Mm -hmm. Fear not the imaginations against thee. Mm -hmm. Let not the incredulity of them trouble thee right. the, that, that right. speak against thee. That's right. Yeah, the, the, basically, don't let the unbelief of those uh, trouble you, man, that speak against us. You know, the two-thirds of Israel, all right, the scoffers, all right, mm -hmm. the... Uh, Edomites. Yeah, Edomites. You know, basically anybody that's you know, a contract to the word of the Lord, man. Yeah, you guys are not troubling us. No, yeah, no. A woman. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah that's right. Family. Right, right. That's right, man. Go ahead. Verse uh, uh verse four. Mm -hmm. For all the unfaithful shall die in their unfaithfulness. That's right. So <laughs> all you that don't believe, you're unfaithful, hey, the most I gonna judge you, man. He's gonna put you to death. Yeah. All right. And we know the, the various plagues and, and, and judgments written up in the Bible. All right, certain things that's not written. All right, the Habashim Yahusha gonna bring upon these people, man. That's yeah. Right. All right. Yeah, that's right. And the scriptures say, "For many are called and few are chosen." That's right. So it's a lot of unbelievers out here that gotta die. We're living in a time of uh, severe judgment that's gonna pop off by the thousands and millions, man. That's right. That's at right. once, in one sweat, you know, about to uh, actually uh, partake on American soil, man. Mm -hmm. Okay, we talking about you know people dying in droves out here. You know, because it's, it's more unfaithful people in the planet Earth than there is faithful. You know, the faithful is is, is uh, far and few, man. The faithful is scattered into remote areas of, of the world. And the Lord is going to establish and protect the, the faithful. But the unfaithful is going to die in their unfaithfulness. That's right. That's you right. Know? I'm going to keep going. <clears throat> it says, um, Behold, said the Lord, I will bring plagues upon the world. Mm -hmm. The sword, famine. Death and destruction. That's right. Yeah, he said he's going to bring these plagues upon the world, man. All right? Like we did that live stream, what was that, last week? About how the calamities in the world is going to increase. Mm -hmm. All right? Mm -hmm. Now, ultimately, the most high is saving America for last. All right? It's like that, 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 that last uh, little, little cherry on top. Huh. All right? The Lord's going to start bring, bringing these plagues on a mass level all over the world, man. Mm -hmm. All right? What did it say? Uh, a sword. All right? Which basically represents death. 
Yep. You know, go ahead. For wickedness have exceedingly polluted the whole earth. Right. Matter of fact, get a uh, get first. Uh, what's that? First John five and uh, nineteen, I believe. Yeah. You look around, man. That the whole earth is riddled in wickedness, man. Yep. All right. And who you got to blame for that? The so called white man. All right. He's to blame because the scriptures say what the earth is given to the hand of the wicked, man. Yeah. So through his power, <clears throat> the whole vibration of the earth is satanic, man. Yeah. You got birds that was um, swimming in the Gulf oil that spill. Is. You know, being polluted, the, the fish of the sea was being polluted. A lot of people was falling sick during that time uh, in, in, in uh, certain areas of, of New Orleans, Florida, Mobile, Alabama. That's right. Because uh, right. they was eating a lot of the fish that had oil uh, in it, man. The mm -hmm. ocean is, is polluted. That's right. Uh, the air is polluted. The, 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 the land is polluted. You got certain areas that used to be rich in certain natural resources and fruits mm -hmm. and vegetation, but now they can't even grow. Right. You know, they can't even produce because the 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 the, the, the Edomites, mm -hmm. okay, have stripped the earth from all of his minerals minerals and his resources, man. That's right. Okay, mm -hmm. essentially uh, uh, making the earth filthy, man. That's right. Okay, the planet Earth right now is filthy up on the inhabitants, man. That's right. You know. Right. That's why. That's why real soon the Most High is gonna root out the Edomites from the rulership, man. All right, because you've done a you've done a horrible job. All right, in trying to maintain the earth, man. The earth is dying. All right, under the rulership of you devils, man. You feel all right? Yeah, I got it. Go ahead. Uh, this is uh, 1 John 5 and 19. Mm -hmm. And we know that we are of the Most High, mm -hmm. and the whole world lieth in wickedness. See that? We know that we are of the Most High. All right, Yahweh Shem Yahweh Shah. And the whole earth lieth <clears throat> life in wickedness, man. All right, the Taliban right, just gave examples of that, man. All right, and not only uh, the, the world, as far as the resources and the elements, but the minds of the, the people are polluted, man. Yeah. You know, I know brother seen that the video of the little... Uh, a little eat of my yeah, kid, yeah. what are they going to a little drag kid or whatever, yeah. with the wig, with the wait, snort cocaine, or whatever. This is madness, man. Yeah. All right, and that's why the Lord's going to bring a, a, a grievous judgment upon this earth, man. Yeah. All right, there's more on that. Uh, no, I got something else. Okay, go ahead, go ahead. This is a uh, second Ezra chapter four, verse thirty. Mm -hmm. For the grain of evil seed have been sown in the heart of Adam from the beginning, mm -hmm. and how much ungodliness have it brought up unto this time. Mm. And how much shall it yet bring forth unto the time of threshing come? Mm -hmm. Ponder now mm -hmm. by thyself how great fruit of wickedness the grain of evil seed have brought forth. That's right. Yeah, that, 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 that seed of wickedness, man, has been, it's been, <laughs> it started small. And then in these last days, man, it's, ex it's exceeding great, man. All right. I think it's another scripture where it says the, the sins have reached into the heavens. Mm -hmm. All right. That's why the Lord got to bring that judgment, man. Because that, that one seal of wickedness, man, Esau took it in and basically ran with it, man. All right? Now he's basically uh, outdoing all the ancient kingdoms, man, as far yeah. as wickedness is concerned. All right? Go ahead. It says, um, and when the ears shall be cut, when the ears shall be cut down, mm -hmm. which are without number, how great a floor shall they fill? Mm -hmm. Then I said, <clears throat> then I answered and said, how? And when shall these things come to pass? Mm -hmm. Wherefore are... Are our years few and evil? And he asked me, saying, Do not thou hasten above the most highest, mm -hmm. for thy haste is in vain to be above him, mm -hmm. but thou hast much exceeded. But the point, the point was already hit home right, on right. how the, the evil seed was sown in the earth and it's increased, mm -hmm. and now you see the fruits of, e of evil out here, man. That's right. All right. Mm -hmm. the, 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 the earth is oversaturated with wicked spirits right now. Mm -hmm. Okay? Right. The earth is, is 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 overly polluted with evil evil uh, uh, vibrations, man. That's right. You go outside, you can feel just satanic energy in the air. Yep. Mm -hmm. yep. Before you, you gotta send a prayer up before you go to the store. Yeah. Yep. 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 You yeah. know, before you get in the car, mm -hmm. you can say something. Yeah, I was gonna say, you know, you got these uh, frequencies constantly fucking with you. Mm -hmm. You know, these uh, cell phone towers and interfering uh, uh, frequencies, all that stuff. It actually interferes with your body, man. That's right. You know. I got something real quick. Okay. This is Isaiah 24 and 5. The earth, oh wait, I'll start at 4. It says, the earth mourneth and fadeth away. Yeah, so like we're going into, the earth is in mourning, man. All right? The whole the whole entire earth is moving under the vibration of, of just straight wickedness, man. All right, I'll keep going. It says, the world languisheth and fadeth away. And this whole earth is fading away, man. Under Esau's rule, everything ha ha is, is like diminished, man. You know, just completely, just just uh, uh, watered down, uh, uh, just just through. Right. Yeah. All right. Uh, 
it says, uh, the haughty people of the earth do language. Yeah, so these proud people being brought low. And here's the point. The earth also is defiled under the inhabitants thereof. Yep. Because they have transgressed the laws, changed the ordinance, broken the everlasting covenant. Mm -hmm. And that shows you that the so-called white man is an unjust ruler, okay? He doesn't belong. The, the earth does not belong under his hands. That's right. Okay? It says uh, it's, it's defiled under under the inhabitants thereof. So it, all you got to do, if, if you're looking for someone to blame about the earth's condition, all you got to do is just look at who's who's the ruling people. Yeah. You, you, know? ride, you ride past a, a, a swamp. Or, or, or rivers, it stinks. You right. know, mm -hmm. you, you driving on a regular casual ride, you smell a stench in the air. Oh man. You know, yeah. Mm -hmm. Everything is just totally whacked out, man. You know, all because, you know, who, who the world calls the, the white race, which according to the Bible, you're known as the Edomites, all because you've taken the power seat and you've utterly polluted everything that you touch, man. You got the opposite of the Midas touch, man. Everything you touch turned into uh into 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 bullshit. That's right. Mm -hmm. You know? That's right, that's right. Every everywhere you go, every every part of the world that you set your feet in, you know, you destroy it, man. Yep. You know? Right. And it's gonna to equate to you even about to de destroy your goddamn self, man. That's right. Mm -hmm. Okay? That's right. Um, I got something real quick. Go ahead, Job 27 and 13. This is the portion of a wicked man with the most high. And the heritage of oppressors, which they shall receive of the Almighty. If his children be multiplied, it is for the sword. Mm -hmm. And his offspring shall not be satisfied with bread. That's right. Mm -hmm. You know, so because you, that, that seed of, of evil has spread abundantly throughout the planet Earth. And your seed has been multiplied. It's for the sword. That's right. This, that means a lot of judgment is coming towards the seed of the evil, man. Mm -hmm. The writing is on the wall, like it tells you in Daniel, the fifth chapter. Right. Okay, so prepare for a mass, a massive judgment, man. We talk about a, a judgment that's going to send a lot of you into a shock factor, man. Mm -hmm. Your body going to shut down because of the amount of judgment that's going to be going on down here. Your legs going to get weak. Mm -hmm. You're not going to be able to run. You're not going to yep. be able to think. You're going to lose your, your speech pattern. You're not going to be able to... It's just going to be so amazing. You're not going to even be able to talk, man. That's right. You know? That's right. You're not gonna be able to, to to breathe correctly. A lot of you people, you're gonna die, you're gonna perish from heart attacks because it's gonna be so overwhelming. Yep. The amount of judgment that's going on out here. Mm -hmm. That's right. You know? Yep, that's right. Yeah, yeah. These these deaths, man, hey, how about Shimmy Shai? You know, he's man, he's he's gonna really outdo himself this time, man. All right, the amount of judgment and death he's gonna bring, it's gonna outdo Egypt. All right, it's gonna outdo the, the different uh, plagues he brought in the past, you know. I got something, if he was finished with that. Yeah, I was done. Okay, I got something real quick. Uh, this is Jeremiah 16 and 4. It says, they shall die of grievous deaths. They shall not be lamented, neither shall they be buried. Yeah, and it's talking about the times to come, man. All right, it's going to be, you people out there, right, starting with uh, two-thirds, all right, you so-called Negroes, Latinos, Native Americans, all right, as well as Esau and other nations, man. All right, you're going to die of grief, grievous deaths, man. You know, the Lord got these, these different beasts out here that haven't been seen yet. You know, he got certain uh, of, of natural disasters Esau ain't even, never even heard of. Mm -hmm. You know, there's going to be all types of things happening, man. You people yeah. are going to be caught in the midst of that, man. Yeah, that's right. It says, uh, it says, uh, but they shall be as dumb upon the face of the earth. Yeah, so yeah, so you may going to have a, 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 a proper burial. You know, we got the funeral, and, you know, singing and bringing the flowers. Yep. You know, all you're going to be is a, is a piece of of, of, of doo doo, <laughs> for lack of a, a better word, on, 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 on the corner of the street, man. Okay. Like, yeah, you're gonna be sitting there decaying, man. It says, uh, it says, and it says, uh, and they shall be consumed by the sword and by famine, and their carcasses shall be meat for the fowls of heaven and for the beasts of the earth. Right. So these these different uh, uh, scavenger animals. You know, they coming into a, a, a damn uh, a buffet, man. Oh yeah. All right, they gonna eat good because there's gonna be a lot of a lot of dead uh, carcasses and bodies out here, man. Yeah, they are gonna be fat out here. Man. That's right. That's why we yeah. we push these prophecies and warning you so so hard. All right, and, and, and you know, with, you know, as scripture say, with with, with, with uh, great heed. All right, because it's serious, man. Mm -hmm. You know. And if it, I can, go ahead. Yeah, yeah, I was just gonna say, uh, add to you, brother. Um, hey, you know, with, with precepts like that, man. That that's that's very graphic, yeah, right. you know. 
That's very graphic and 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 uh, destructive, man. And yeah. you know, you people, uh, these other groups and these other, uh, you know, these churches, they're not going into precepts like these, man. Right, right. They're not going into the into the the, the realness, okay, the, the the dark side of the scripture, so to speak, mm -hmm. okay, the judgment side of things. Mm -hmm. All right, we're the ones that's that's warning you of what's happening. You know, uh, bodies decaying on the streets. This these things are are serious, man. You know, you watch these movies and, and you, you know, you witness all these things, you know, all these people, you know, graphic images and, and people just dying of, of, of grievous deaths, like the scriptures say. Mm -hmm. And and yet people are not people not even uh, warning you, man. That's right. Except for great millstone through the spirit of your That's right. Y'all both got it. Uh, yeah, I got something real quick. Go ahead. This is, uh, Isaiah chapter three, verse eleven. Mm -hmm. Woe unto the wicked. It shall be ill with him, Come. for the reward of his hand shall shall be given him. That's right. And that's why the Lord is increasing the wicked seed because it's been sown. So now the fruits of wickedness is growing. But what's going to end up happening is though because those fruits are corrupted, it's going to wither away through the judgment. Right. That's right. Okay. That's right. The Lord is going to send back them, them evil angels to pretty much cut off the wicked man mm -hmm. because they ain't the ones that the Lord want to gather for his harvest. That's right. That's right. Okay. The Lord is coming to cut off the evil seed, man. And a lot of you, you Israelites, two thirds of you, have partaken in that, in that, uh, that, and let that seed take root within your spirit, man. Mm -hmm. So to where two thirds of you, you, you cross the point of no return, man. That's right. It ain't no coming back for two thirds of you, uh, you devils out here, man. That's right. That's okay? right. Okay. Yep. Period. Point blank. Because you, you drunk of the wine of the wrath of the serpent. That's right. Mm -hmm. Okay. Hey, hey, wait, wait, that's that's the book of uh, what's that? Um, Isaiah the thirteenth chapter, man. All right, where it says, um, matter of fact, I, I get it real quick. I can't, I can't quote it off my head. Yeah, because you, you Jake's men that that are basically um, Jake's that are basically in in in, in cahoots. Yeah, join hands. You know, yeah, yeah, yep, that's it. I'm gonna just read it real quick. This is um, Isaiah thirteen and uh, fifteen. It's just the back of the title one. This is um, Isaiah thirteen fifteen. Everyone that is found shall be thrust through. And everyone that is joined unto them shall fall by the sword. That's mm. right. Yep. Yeah. So you, you know, you drinking that wine, so you, yep. know, you, you cleave to that philosophy of Esau. You know his ways and his, his doctrine. Hey, they will you're gonna get the same judgment that he get, man. Yep. Which is death, destruction. All right, and thermonuclear fire, man. You're gonna get uprooted. That's right. You're gonna get uprooted, man. Yep. We living in a time right. of the the uh, the uprooting of the evil seed, man. That was That's planted right. in the in the in the earth, man. And, and everybody. That uh, live on in the planet Earth at one point in time in their life went off. Mm -hmm. Right, Adam, and because it started with Adam. Yep. The only person that never that stepped foot on American or not American soil, but on soil period that didn't sin was Yahweh Shai. He was a perfect man. Everybody else went off in one way or another. Okay, some more than others, right. but those men that that give a diligent inquisition on how to be saved. On how to please the Lord, how to turn back, how to abstain from wickedness, mm -hmm. cleansing their way, purifying their way. The Lord is going to, to, to gather them and, 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 bring, and, and bring them back to the marriage of Yahweh Shah. But the rest of that evil seed that's been sown in the minds and in the spirit of these people, you're going to be uprooted by the reapers, man. That's right. Which are the angels. The angels are going to come back and do the separate. Okay? Right. He's going to separate the, the righteous from the wicked. That's right. You know, as a matter of fact, somebody get that in, um, in Matthew 25, Matthew 25 and 32, and then hold Matthew uh, 13 and 49, because it goes into the, the angels and how the angels are going to reap. So that's why we have to make sure that the fruits of the spirit, the righteous fruits of the spirit are circulating through our, through our spirit so that when the angels come back, we'll be a vessel of honor fit for salvation. That's right. And we won't have to be cut off and destroyed with the wicked. We'll be, we'll be gathered with the righteous. Okay. Mm -hmm. Uh, bring that Matthew 25. Uh, uh, verse 32. 32? Oh. Yeah, got it. Yeah, I got it. Go ahead. Uh, this is uh, Matthew 25 and 32. And before him shall be gathered all nations, mm -hmm. and he shall separate them one from another, mm -hmm. as a shepherd divided his sheep mm -hmm. from the goats. That's right. So that, this, we in the separation phase, where the Lord is sitting the wicked on this side, mm -hmm. and he's sitting the, uh, the, the righteous on that side. And that deciding factor is going to be that microchip, man. That's right. Okay? You're going to put the microchip in the middle of the separation, and you're going to see all the wicked reach out and grab that chip, man. 
And that's going to solidify the judgment of the wicked, man. Okay? Because we live, like I said earlier, we living in a time where the seed of the wicked must be cut off and destroyed. Because they exceedingly polluted the earth. They haven't just polluted it. They exceedingly polluted the earth, man. That's right, that's right. Like the earth is in turmoil beyond what we even know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's they right. burn it. They, they, they burn it, um holes through layers, you know? They, they're burning through the layers of the firmaments, man. You know what I'm saying? Yep. Mm -hmm. They they yeah, pollute yeah. in clouds. They can create storms. They can manipulate weather. Yeah, we, we really don't even know half half the wickedness this devil's doing, man. Right, yeah. That's why the Lord is, is, is doing that doing that separation, separating one from the next. And then get that uh Matthew 13 and 49. I'll toss it back to you. Watch that. Matthew's uh, 13 and 49. It's a, I got one more verse on that, uh, Matthew 25. Go okay, ahead. go ahead, come on. And he shall set the sheep on his right hand, but the goats on the left. That's right. And the sheep represents the lost sheep of the house of Israel, the elect of the Israelites, which the Israelites consist of you Negroes, Hispanic, Native, and Seminole Indians, and you confusion of face that's scattered amongst the other nations who lineage on their father's side go back to the seed of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. You are the children of Israel. That's right. Okay? So the Lord, that those sheep consist of the descendants of those people, the Israelites. Mm -hmm. The righteous of those descendants is the who the Lord is going to separate and gather. The unrighteous of the descendants of the Israelite, the Lord is going to separate on the left side and destroy them. Mm -hmm. Right along with the other nations in, 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 in Esau. That's right. Okay? And the angels of the heavens... The Lord is using to to do all the the, the, the reaping, the separations. Mm -hmm. That's right. Bring it out. Oh, um, yeah. Right. This is uh, Matthew thirteen and uh, verse forty nine. Mm -hmm. So it shall be at the end of the world. Uh -huh. The angels shall come forth mm -hmm. and sever the wicked from among the just. Well, like we just read in Matthew twenty fifth chapter. Yep. That was the severance of the mm -hmm. wicked and the just. And how are we being separated? What is that de defining? Um, Thing that's separating the, the, the wicked from the just. This the Holy Spirit, the right. scriptures. Mm -hmm. All right, the Bible, <clears throat> the name of Yahweh Bashima was shot. Mm -hmm. That's the separation. All right, because the righteous are going to gravitate towards the Holy Spirit and a high calling, and the rest, they're going to continue in the ways of Babylon. They're going to continue to do things that displeasing to the Lord, that's pleasing to Satan. They're going to continue to get uh, gain, uh, ill gotten gains. Continue to commit adultery, continue to do drugs, continue to do lewd and filthy acts, continue to, to uh, uh, speak profanity when it comes to the scriptures in the Christian churches. Yep. Okay? So the angels ain't doing nothing but just sifting them and, 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 and setting them on over to the <coughs> side of judgment. And the Lord's preserving <coughs> the righteous, putting the righteous on another side to be protected and shielded in that day. <coughs> while he bring that, that hex, that hex out, man. Wow. <sighs> Just straight up and down, uprooting the wicked, man. Right we in a we in a phase of the we in the beginning phases of the uprooting <clears throat> of the evil seed, man. That's right, right. Okay, that's right. You got it, bro. Kind of, I finish the last verse, verse, uh, verse fifty. It says, "And shall cast them into the furnace of fire." That's right, and and that, that's <clears throat> all the way to when the ICBM nuclear missiles drop, man. That's right. Okay, mm -hmm. two thirds of you, uh, if you make it that far. And you Edomites, and a lot of you Hamitic, Japhetic, uh, uh, Moabitic, <laughs> you know, all of you, all of you nations that's over here, and you still intact, you are gonna get hit by the missiles too. That's right. Mm -hmm. Okay. That's right. Yep. You gonna get hit by the, you gonna get put in that furnace of fire as well. Yep. If the Lord, if the, if the if the Lord or Satan put the spirit on you to to get a visa, get a green card. Travel your chinky eye ass over here, get a house, get a job, get a nail shop, live it up. Yep. Sustain, you're gonna take the chip. Yep, yep. He did all that just so your ass can eat a missile. Yep, that's right. Because he wanted to get some get back. Mm -hmm. Okay? Mm -hmm. Get some get the, the time of revenge is at hand, man. That's right. Alright? A lot of things gonna be popping off in 2019, the year of Karabna. Hey, like the brother Rogers, I said yesterday, man, buckle up, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> buckle up, man. That's yeah. right. Yeah, it's, it's gonna be like, it's gonna be heavy, man. All right, yeah, Karakma, man, that shit, man. It's gonna be a lot of a lot of death, destruction, you know, different uh, strange and, and marvelous acts and works, you know, taking place, man. Yeah. 
You know, so you gotta buckle up and be ready, man. Mm -hmm. All right, I'm gonna finish this verse off. It, it, right. Do you have a scripture? Yeah, I got something after. All right, it's a verse, uh, Matthew 13 and 50. It says, uh, and shall cast them into the furnace of fire. There shall be wailing and gnashing of teeth. Woo! Yep. 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 People gonna be them, cause cause they're not gonna just give up the spirit, man. Right. They're gonna feel they're gonna feel mm -hmm. the effects of that nuclear fire, man. That's right. So they're gonna be in pain. That's that's symbolic of being in pain and agony, man. Mm -hmm. Being tortured, yeah. terrorized, man. Yep. By that nuclear fire, man. Fire. Mm -hmm. Imagine that fire burning your scalp, your eardrums. You know, burning burning your brain. God damn it. You know, you know, just liquefying your ass. Yeah. You still, you still trying to make out what the fuck is happening. Man. Right, right. You know, mm -hmm. being, being teeth, melted, man. Yeah. teeth burning. I let's who say eyes yeah, bones. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 yep. Ner your nerves, your, yep. your, your, uh, your heart, heart is on fire, man. Just she like hurt, that, man. Yeah, yeah. Just like yeah. that movie. Um, what's that movie where she was holding the fence? Uh, uh, Terminator. 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 Uh, yep. Terminator two. Yeah, Terminator two. Yeah, yeah. Terminator two. That's a classic. Uh, uh, Movie, uh, movie clip that brothers always use. Hey, but that that's the perfect example of what's gonna happen. These people, flesh is literally gonna just disintegrate, man. Yep. This is Ezekiel 20 and 30, 38. And I will purge out from, from among you the rebels and them that transgress against me. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so hey, the Lord is gonna, like, like we went into the sifting, right? The Lord is gonna purge out the rebels, meaning the, the ones that are, that are. And wickedness, the ones that are joined to Esau's system, mm -hmm. he's gonna purge them out, and and everyone that transgresses against him, man. It says, "I will bring them forth out of the country where they sojourn, where they sojourn, and they shall not enter into the land of Israel, and ye shall know that I am the Lord." Mm -hmm. Yeah, and that's and you know that scripture right there is yeah. going to after uh, wilderness, after the oh, kind of, yep, yep. you know, in the yeah. wilderness. But that the Lord that, is doing yeah. the purging right yeah. now as yeah. well. That's right. That's right. You know, he's severing the the, 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 the the wicked from among the just. Okay, because really, essentially, man, they don't want to be around us, and we don't want to be around them. That's right. You know, so the Lord is, is making a clear separation, man. You know, that's why you notice, man, a lot of brothers, man, brothers don't really be on Instagram, Facebook, right. you know, the, uh, all these social media platforms, leaving comments, frolicking with the world, man. Wasting time. Linking up. Yeah, you linking up. You know, me. pull up. Right, right. No. You ain't gonna want to be around me, and I'm not, and I don't want to be around you. And that's really how brothers operate, man. We yeah. got our own little world, man. We don't want to be around niggas, and niggas don't want to be around us. Right. It's an even trade off. Yep. So because that that's the case, the Lord is gonna come back and judge this place and see who's right and who's wrong, man. Mm -hmm. And the wicked, man, the wicked is gonna receive uh, many stripes, man. That's right, right. Many stripes for the amount of abomination they're committing under the heavens, man. That's right. You know, the, the amount of disregard, disrespect, you know, dishonesty, you know, just just un, unfruitful works, man. You know, very utterly disrespectful to the Heavenly Father. And they treat his creations like it's a piece of crap, man. Yep. You know, especially you black women, man. You black women. Oh, yeah. Yeah, you're about to catch the shit in oh, of the stick, man, man yeah. for lack of better words, man. Excuse yeah. my uh my my language, you French. know, but that that that's that's essentially what it's gonna boil down to, man. That's right. You're going to see women out here just, you know, getting getting passed around like a damn rag doll, man. That's right. Just got damn raped by 10 dudes in one day. And then, then just get sent off and just let, left to be distraught. Then just end up just dying, man. Yeah. That's it. Yep. They were, they were spirit. That was spirit. You know, the spirit jumped on Pastor Ramla through that lesson. You know, the you know, other brothers followed up. That was like the theme, kind of the theme of the week, man. You women, man. All right. Mm -hmm. Receiving harsh judgments, man. Brothers going into that heavy man the past couple of days, man. And you see it. They say the the uh what's that, second minute eight and fifty? All right, for great misery shall come to them that dwell in the world because they walk in a great pride. Man, the damn woman, in particular the Israelite woman and Esau, they damn near neck and neck in pride, man. Yeah. You know, I might I might give Esau the slight edge, you know, by 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 uh by uh 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 hair. <laughs> you know. But the damn Israelite woman is right, is right, <laughs> damn it, neck and neck, man. All right. right. So when you have Hashem Yasha bring those plagues and his death, man, just know that what you was, you was warned, man. You was told. All right. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, so I got something real quick. This okay. is uh, Proverbs nineteen and twenty nine. Mm -hmm. Judgments are prepared for scorners and stripes for the back of fools. Woo. Yeah. Hey, judgment is prepared, man. 
All right. Like, like you, like you sit down to eat at the table and the food is already prepared. It's laid out. Yeah. Got your fork, your knife, your napkin, mm -hmm. glass of wine. Mm -hmm. You know, got your plate there. Hey, that's the judgment waiting for you. You uh niggas, man. Yeah, hot right. and ready. You know, hot, hot and ready, man. That's right. Literally, man. The, the missile, man. Yeah. You know, along with the along with the other uh, host of plagues, man. Mm -hmm. You know, for you people. Hey, and hey, it says the uh matter of fact, you should hold that scripture. Yeah, yeah. Read it again. It's uh, Proverbs 19 and 29. Mm -hmm. Judgments are prepared for scorners mm -hmm. and stripes for the back of fools. Stripes for the for the back of fools, man. Alright? So a lot of, you got hey, you got a lot of uh, fools in Israel, man. You know, these guys that can't get the breakdowns, scoffing. Yeah. You know, guys that just come out of nowhere, questioning the questioning the apostles and elders. You yeah. know, hey, that that's hey, the score is the score is prepared for you, man. All right, how about Shimmy Al Shad? And another thing, brothers, been saying lately, a lot of judgment gonna come this year to a lot of you, uh, you phony Israelites, man. Mm -hmm. All right, a lot of you false teachers, you know, you guys that is crept in unawares with your own agenda, you know, talking crap on YouTube and on the comic board. You know, a lot of you guys gonna get judged, man. You know, and it's beautiful because we've been we've been waiting for this, man. Yeah. All right. Hey, some of you guys gonna be, gonna be public public examples, man. Yeah. And, all right. You know, and that's gonna pump more fear in Israel. Yeah, yeah, that's it. Yeah, that's it. Okay. I got, I got something to put in here. Uh, this is um, Ezekiel 22 and 20. Mm -hmm. I'm going to read down 22. Right. It said, As they gather silver and brass and iron and lead and tin into the midst of the furnace to blow the fire upon it, to melt it, mm -hmm. so will I gather you in my anger and my fury, and I will leave you there and melt you. Oh, man. We, we just gave an example, man. And movie Terminator 2. You know that, that horrific depiction of the damn eating my woman on the fence, melting, yep. flesh consuming away. That's straight, that's straight out the scriptures, man. Yeah, straight liquefied. Straight, straight liquefied, man. Yeah. You know? And it's hard to liquefy right. uh, a, a human body, man. Right. You know? Cause, yeah. cause, because of the, the, uh, the molecular structure, okay, <laughs> of the body. Yeah, yeah. You know, it's not the easiest thing to burn through. Right. You know, you got a lot of tissue, muscle, mm -hmm. uh, joints, marrow, bones, blood, you know, so right. it's not the easiest thing to burn through. And them cremation, uh, them cremation things be uh, like 5,000 degrees and, and stuff like that, I think. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And, and this one's going to be <laughs> hotter than that. Hotter than that. It's going to liquefy. It's going to liquefy. It's going to turn mm -hmm. into a vapor, man. Mm -hmm. You know, I'm going to keep going. It says, yay, I will gather you and blow upon you in the, in the, fire of my wrath and ye shall be melted in the midst thereof mm. as still if i say you mentioned if it said gather going back to your point where you mentioned how these different nations is coming over into america thinking they're going to live it up and, and live uh, uh, uh all joyful that's mm -hmm. the spirit of, that's the lord directing you to this to this uh to this death trap man yeah all right he's ga gathering the people all right to what to, to, to bring you here and melt you man with the missiles man yeah all right go ahead all right, continuing on, it says, As silver is melted in the midst of the furnace, mm -hmm. so shall ye be melted in the midst thereof, and ye shall know that I, the Lord, have poured out my fury upon you. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Then in that time, then you're going to know it was, the, it was the judgment of Yahweh Hashem Yahweh Shah, man. Because right now, the majority of people, you don't, you don't know Yahweh Hashem Yahweh Shah. All right, but you're getting ready to. All right, when the Lord brings bring his judgment, yep. all right, especially in the form of that nuclear fire, then, then you're going to know Power of Israel, man. Yeah. You're going to know your how about Shimmy Yahweh Shah. Go no, ahead. Really that was it? Mm -hmm. Okay, I had something. The brothers have quoted it. Uh, uh, Zechariah 14 and 12. It says, And this shall be the plague wherewith the Lord will smite all the people that have fought against Jerusalem. It says, Their flesh shall consume away while they stand upon their feet. Yeah, and that's, that's serious judgment, man. Mm -hmm. Being consumed while you stand on your feet. That's that's heavy judgment. How many people you know died standing straight up, man? You know, a lot of people at least yeah. have the, the, the amount of time to at least drop. Right, right, right. Let the spirit leave. A lot of you people's spirit is, is gonna get is totally wiped out while you're still on your feet, man. Mm. You know, gonna melt you clean away, man. And it all it all goes back yeah. to that evil seed, mm -hmm. that evil seed taking root in the hearts of the rebellious. That's right. You know, a lot of people, you love wickedness, man. You love evil. Mm -hmm. You love rebellion. You know, you seek, uh, 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 you know, uh, um, 
uh, to be again. You seek opposition against the heavenly Father, man. Okay, you don't want to do the things that's right. You desire to do the things that's wrong. So the reward of it is death. That's right. That's right. Matter of fact, um, you know, because it's a payment for everything. That's right. That's right. You know, mm -hmm. uh, I, I want to get that real quick in Romans. Mm -hmm. uh, the wages of the wages. Yeah, yeah, wages of sin is death. Mm -hmm. I'll get it real quick. That's uh, right. Yeah, it's, it's a it's a, it's, a, it's a payment for that. Man. Mm -hmm. You gotta you gotta you gotta pay your tab. Yeah. You know, build up a, 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 a receipt of a, a tab of wickedness. <laughs> All right, a portfolio of wicked works. Hey, you gotta, you gotta, you gotta pay that. You gotta, yeah, pay that to tab, buddy. You gotta cash out. You gotta, you gotta cash it out. Man. Yeah, this you is know? Romans six and twenty three. Mm -hmm. For the wages of sin is death. That's right. But man. the gift of the Most High is eternal life through Hamashiach Yahweh Shai, our Lord. Mm -hmm. So if you out here going clean off, you, you like, you know, uh, 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 Billy Mayhem when it comes to wickedness, you just running to and fro throughout the earth. The payment of it is death. That's right. That's that's the exchange. It's an even exchange. You want to go off, okay? You go off, but you're gonna die. That's you right. Know, you want to do right, okay? You can do right. You're gonna live. That's the payment. But it's harder to do right in a land where wickedness has been taking root, man. That's right. So the Lord didn't didn't he didn't make this a a, a cakewalk, man. Okay. The Lord set up certain stipulations and hurdles so that he so that you can prove to him, you know, that you're willing to do the right thing. By dwelling in a realm where wickedness has taken root, and you still have to carry yourself in a righteous manner, okay? That's right. But because a lot of you, you Israelites, you you love rebellion; it feels good to you. You get that adrenaline rush mm -hmm. of doing wickedness, robbing banks and shooting at people, committing adultery. Yep. You know, doing these drugs, and you 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 get a kick out of getting away yeah. with mischief, man. Mm -hmm. But the reward of it is death. That's right. That's the reward of doing it, man. That's right. But the, the payment of righteousness is life. Yep. But the 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 the, heart, the, the, the kicker is that is is it, it makes it difficult to be all the way on point because wickedness has taken root in the earth. So now we gotta prove it through our works mm -hmm. and our faith. That's right. Okay? I add, add something real quick. Uh this is uh this back up your point. This is a uh, Proverbs. 8 and 35. It says, For whoso findeth me, findeth life. Mm -hmm. Ooh. And shall obtain favor of the Lord. Yep. It says, And uh yep. when we found the how about shot through the spirit. The Lord called us and we found him. Now we have to hold on uh and make that calling sure mm -hmm. through our labors and through our works. That's right. That's why we should be trimming our lamps like Apostle Bar just did a video about the proper arrangement. Mm -hmm. Uh, in, in trimming, man. Okay, so we're supposed to be in a mind frame of trimming, growing, getting better. You know, uh, positioning ourselves spiritually to be able to receive of the promises of our forefathers, man. That's right. Okay, put yourself in a good position and set yourself up to succeed in the truth, man. And the, the step number one is you got the name, you got the truth, you got the brotherhood. You know what to do. That's right. Okay. It ain't like the Lord has left you out here clueless. You got examples before you. Right. So now you can set yourself up and put yourself in a position to where your chances of you being saved can increase as you continue to show the Lord, man. That's right. You know, through your diligence. Mm -hmm. Go ahead, bro. Well, verse 36, it says, But he that sinneth against me wrongeth his own soul. That's right. If you sin against the Alabashim Shai, you wrong your own soul. Right. All right, you you think you, you think you getting down on the Lord? You ain't getting down on the Lord. You getting down on yourself. That's right. All right, I, I, let me add something to you real quick, right, like, right, real right, quick. Right. I'm gonna toss it right back. This is uh, Second Ezra one and twenty seven. Mm -hmm. Ye have not as it were forsaken me, but your own self, mm -hmm. you save the Lord. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You know, I yeah. just wanted to throw that in there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, because you when you commit wickedness and you moving in the spirit of pride, arrogancy. Mm -hmm. Just rash, you know, hate uh, correction, hate guidance, hate reproof. Mm -hmm. You wrong in your own soul. Yep. You ain't hurting the Lord. Mm -hmm. You might prove your point at that one particular time, but you hurting yourself in the long run. That's because right. that spirit is, is going to take root and overthrow the righteousness within you, man. That's right. You know, go ahead. I yep. It says, uh, it says, but he that sinneth against me, wrong of his own soul. Mm -hmm. All they that hate me love death. Man, Ooh. see, yeah, yeah. Yep. so uh, that, uh, when you see a lot of these little young 
these young whippersnappers out here getting peached up, these gang members, and right. they, it's because they hate the Lord. Mm-hmm. That's right. That's you know? Right. Hey, yeah. hey, what the scriptures say, uh, whoever perish being yeah, innocent. Yeah. You know, so a lot of these, like we said, little young um, nigglets, you know, that's getting, they like say, getting pieced up, mm-hmm. you know, getting their heads, heads clapped. Yeah. That's the judgment of the yeah. Lord, man. This dude is wicked. Yeah. You know, which, you know, which is another topic for another day, but you got like a little girl that, you know, that shot was in Houston, Texas. Oh, yeah, yeah. Seven year old girl. Hey, she got more likely got judged for something she did in her past life, man. Yeah. You know, anybody who sees the judgment, man, nobody's is, is, is innocent, man. Yeah, you got a you girl know? out here, a little 15, 16 year old girl, got shot in the shoulder. Uh, you know, somebody shot her house up, I guess. Right. Maybe was looking for a brother. Mm-hmm. Shot her house up. She was in, on the couch. She got struck in the shoulder and died, man. Yeah. You know, that's right. Pushed it up, pushed it in, man. You know? And like like the brother said, because you know, paying paying for the sins of the past life, man. I got something real quick. And that's that was that was that was that was that was a simple judgment. Yeah, that's 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 quick, yep. quick and simple, that's right. quick and out of the way. Yep. Oh man, the heavenly Father, Yahweh Bashimah was shy, is about to bring wrath. We talking about power in which we've never witnessed yeah. in, in this flesh right now, man. Right. And, and a lot of that judgment is going to rest on the rebellious, man. That's right. You know? That's right. You got it, come on. Come on. It's Deuteronomy 30 and 15. See, I have set before thee this day life and good and death and evil. Mm. That's right. So, hey, and, you know, the Lord is talking to uh, Israel, <clears throat> you know, but but basically that's the choice, you know, like, like the brother's going into is, you know... <clears throat> If you're going to uh, obey the, the Lord and his commandments, which actually is getting ready to go into, mm-hmm. then that's life, okay? The Lord has set, hey, the uh, the red pill and the blue pill. Yeah, I was, you know? I was thinking of that too. Mm-hmm. Was, yep, yep, go ahead. Yeah. That's, but yeah, that, if you watch The Matrix, right? He's basically like, all right, you know, uh, I can't forget which one is which. Yeah. But the, the red pill was like, you know, you could just stay in your delusions and stay just living your wicked life and, and not, not worry about the consequences. Well, you know, until until you know you get judged, right? But uh, but the the blue pill or whichever, you know, was was to um to live uh, uh, in righteousness, to live in the know, and to understand the system, understand who your enemy is, mm-hmm. understand uh, uh, judgment. Mm-hmm. You know, I'm gonna keep going. It says, "In that day, I command thee this day to love the Lord thy power, to walk in His ways, and to keep His commandments and His statutes and His judgments." That thou mayest live and multiply. That's right. So, hey, the Lord wants you to live. You know? Yahweh Shemiah wants wants the ones who are right, he wants them to live. But it must needs be that, that you know, the, the majority is going to have to die. You know? As a part of prophecy. It says, and the Lord, thy power shall bless thee and the land whither thou goest to possess it. All right? Like I said, that's talking about the whole of Israel. But the point being that. He set the decision of life and death uh, before Israel, man. Right. And, and most of you hard-headed niggas, you chose death. Mm-hmm. You know? That brother got it. Uh, I'll get something real quick just to follow you up okay. on that. Uh, I think it's in Ecclesiastes 17. No, it's 15. Yeah, it's 15. So Ecclesiastes 15 and 17. Um, well, I'm starting at 16. It says, He have set fire and water before thee. Stretch forth thy hand unto whether thou wilt, before man is life and death, mm-hmm. and whether him life it shall be given him. Mm-hmm. So it's clear. Mm-hmm. A lot of these people, they live in the spirit of death, man. Yeah. They love going to funerals. They love hearing about such and such got shot. Mm-hmm. They love taking drugs. Yep. They love doing, doing things that's counter life mm-hmm. and not pro-life. We pro-life over here. Yeah. We for living. We want to live. We want to live a long, healthy life with abundant, you know, abundant resources, women having the wisdom, knowledge, and understanding of the Lord, having abundant fear of the Lord, mm-hmm. abundant faith. We all about life. Right. But a lot of you people, you out here, you hate life. Mm-hmm. And you hate the process that it takes in order to achieve it, man. You can't stand it. You just want that instant gratification, which mm-hmm. a lot of wickedness comes through instant gratification, man. Right. Okay? Yeah. That's usually the avenue to wickedness, it's a short, it's a short path, man. Okay, that's right. So hey, that, that, essentially, these people take it, man. That's right. Mm-hmm. 
Right you know, here. they look for a quick fix mm -hmm. of what they do. They just go hit their pipe. Yeah, it's easy. Yeah. You know, they just go hit the crack pipe because they they they, they want to go through the quick fix because they might be going through something instead of just actually dealing with it and sending up prayers to how about Shemal Shai and letting him take time to fix it. Mm -hmm. You rather just go hit the crack pipe. Or instead of the Lord waiting on you, waiting, or instead of you waiting on the Lord to send you a woman, you know, you go and commit adultery. Right, right, right. You know? Right. And, you know, something happened where, you know, a friend or somebody like that might, might get shot. Instead of the Lord, you waiting for the Lord to avenge that individual, you go and avenge it. Because you people love the way of wickedness, man. That's right. They walk around with your RPT shirts. Y'all love that shit, man. Yeah, yeah. You know? That's right. That's why the scripture say, whatsoever he love, it shall be given, man. Us brothers here, we love life. We want to live. We want to see the fall of our enemy. We want to be the first ones to make it into the kingdom of heaven, or defeating the, the spirit of death. Like the scripture say, oh, death, where is thy sting? Mm -hmm. yeah. We don't want to go down and get cut off with the wicked. Right. When we ain't out here partaking in half the stuff, crap, you people are doing out here, man. We don't want to partake in that madness. We want to be separated and shielded in the time of trouble to where the Lord will preserve us from the sting of death, man. You know? That's right. Because we hate, we hate death. Nobody just want to die. Right. Except niggas. And right. Edomites, you, Edomites, you love death, too. Yeah, yeah, oh yeah, yeah. Walk yeah. around with black, black lipstick on, black fingernails, black yeah, hair, yeah, black yeah. eyelids, listening to dark music. Black, yeah, black the hell out. Yeah. Slit your uh, wrist. Just real dark energy, man. Yeah. That's death. Mm -hmm. Tatting yourself up, eating all yeah, kinds of nasty yeah. foods. They love death. So the Lord gonna give it to you in abundance. Mm -hmm. That's right. I'm gonna finish it off. Yep. For the wisdom of the Lord is great. And he, he is mighty in power and beholdeth all things. His and his eyes are upon them that fear him, and he knoweth every work of man. He hath commanded no man to do wickedly, neither have he given any man license to sin. Mm -hmm. So a lot of you people out here, you breaking up you you breaking the Lord's law. That's right. He didn't give you a license to do that. If you out here driving around these American streets without a license, you gotta be licensed mm -hmm. to drive. You gotta you gotta be given the the, the the green light yeah. to drive because right. if you don't if you don't have that license, mm -hmm. okay, you breaking the law. Mm -hmm. That's right. So when you sin, that's that's not approved. Right, right. It's not stamped. Right. So Nobody so. gave you a a, a, right, a right. sin card. <laughs> right. right. A sin license. Yes. No, the Lord didn't give nobody a sin license. That's right. Yeah, because that word license really it just means permission. Mm -hmm. Yep. Yeah. Permission. Yeah. Yeah. And hey. No one really gets permission to sin, man. Mm -hmm. You know, how about Shmi Alshai set up his laws, you know, for you to for you to keep them, mm -hmm. you know, and the elect is is pardoned by the sins that that really the elect are the only ones that can be uh, pardoned by their sins. But that even the elect don't get a free pass, right? You know, to just sin, mm -hmm. you know. Right. Was, right. Yeah, that was all I had. I, yeah. I was trying to find the scriptures, but I, I just I, I bring this one out. This is uh this is Jeremiah eight and three. You know, going to basically hitting that point of, of, of how people just choose death, man. You know, you got that, that right, right, that right and that left. Yeah. You know, the most high making that uh, separation, man, and, and basically giving you two ways, man. You're gonna get down with his word and, and you know his men, or you're gonna choose the way of uh, death, man. Mm -hmm. Alright, this is um this is Jeremiah eight and three. It says, and death shall be chosen rather than life by all the residue of them that remain of this evil family. And that evil family is particularly talking about two-thirds of Israel, man. All right? Like you read it up, uh, and, uh, also in Jeremiah, I believe in Jeremiah 24, when they gave a parable of the figs. All right? So some of them were uh, good, and the other ones were terrible to look at. Something like that. Mm -hmm. You know? And that's you, that's you Jake's, man. You Jake's will cleave on to death, man. By what following after the ways of, of America, Esau, you know, a lot of jokes are uh, straight up homosexuals, you know. Uh, uh hey, hey, these rappers, you know, look at some of these rappers, they look, literally look like demons. Yep, yep. You know, like Travis Scott and uh, uh you, you know, you know, yeah, it's different. Yeah, they look, they, they look like demons, man. Mm -hmm. All right, because you chosen, you cleaving unto death. It says, uh, it says, which it says, which remain in all the places where whither I have driven them. Uh, saith the Lord of hosts. It says, uh, 
I read verse 4. It says, Moreover, thou shalt say unto them that say the Lord, Shall they fall and not arise? Shall he turn away and not return? Why then is this people of Jerusalem slitten back by a perpetual backsliding? They hold fast deceit. They refuse to return. That's why, man, Jake's you pretty much sealed. Your fate is sealed, man. Yeah. All right, you and that, that, that company of the two-thirds, man. Hey, the script is saying that, you know, they, they refuse to return, man. So why even, even, even try to teach you, man? Yeah, you know, we just gonna read the scriptures and just give you judgment, man. Yeah, that's where it's only going out for the elect. Yeah, yep. let the Lord raise up them stormtroopers against your ass. That's right. Mm -hmm. That's right. Now I got something real quick. You got something? Kind, I got something real quick. I'll go after you. All right, Con, this is um Isaiah 29 and 2. It says, Yet I will distress Ariel, and there shall be heaviness and sorrow, and it shall be unto me as Ariel. And and that word Ariel in the Hebrew is uh Ariel, which means um Lion of the Most High, and that's Ariel is also another word for Israel. Okay, you got the Lion of Judah. Okay, so that that word the scripture says, yeah, "Woe be right, to right. Ariel." Now I'm gonna keep reading. It says, "And I will mm -hmm. encamp against thee round about, and will lay siege against thee with the mount, and I will raise forts against thee." Yeah, that's martial law. The Lord said He's gonna lay siege against you with the mount. That's a government. All right, that those are the troops that the Lord is going to send to uh, attack the right. Israelites, man. Yep. It's talking about Ariel, the the, uh, the 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 Lion of the Most High. That's right. You know, which are which is which is Israel, man. Okay. You know, so the Lord has already marked a lot of you for death, and he's he's also marking certain men and women for life, man. That's right. Certain women out here that that, that got a man and, and and they sticking it out with him mm -hmm. in the truth, you know, supporting the brotherhood. You know, send, sending money in when they can, you know, trying their best to, 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 to stick it out year after year, going through the hell with the man, not giving up. Right. The, the, uh, the Lord going to save a lot of those women. Yep, that's right. You know? Yeah. The, the ones that's on the comment board listening in all sincerity and meekness, waiting patiently for the Lord to send a man their way. Mm -hmm. You know? Building themselves up in the spirit to, to, uh, to uh, 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 endure. Through, the, through them times, the Lord gonna have mercy on some of those women. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. But you nigga boo, women with the big with the big ass eyelashes, with the glitter, oh, man. with the glitter on it, with the stank box, you ain't going uh, nowhere. You gonna stay right in the mirror. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you gonna you gonna be you gonna be dusted off real quick, man. All right, got to get hot by shooting on shot, get get up through with you, man. Yeah, a lot of bucket yeah. kicking. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah there's gonna be a lot, of, a lot of buckets being kicked in that day, man. Yeah, man, a lot of the, you know, you know, a lot of, you know, I call, I call them daisy pushes, man. <laughs> you know, yeah, dirt naps, that's right. yeah. dirt nappers, yeah, like, like dirt naps happening. <laughs> this is uh, Ezekiel thirty three and eleven. You know? Say unto them, as I say, as I live, saith the Lord Yahweh, I have no pleasure in the death of the wicked, but that the wicked turn from his evil way, slack it, turn from his way and live. That's, hey, oh, yeah, hey, you got it. Hey, right. I was saying, yeah, so Yahweh, Yahweh, Yahweh would rather that you repent, man. Mm -hmm. You know, he would rather that you turn you turn to his word, you know, you turn to his, the words of the prophets, mm -hmm. you know, and you, you uh, 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 shape it up, man. You know, go ahead. God says, turn ye, turn ye from your evil ways, for why will ye die, O house of Israel? <laughs> hey, we just read that, what, uh, two thirds of chosen death, man. You know, so you basically sealed your fate. You've cho you chosen your own. Your own fate, man. Yeah. All right. Because the men of the Lord have been on the highways and byways for, for, for decades. All right. Uh, uh, bringing out this truth, man. Yeah. You know, and Jake, as it, as it says, and I believe it was, a, um, I want to say, uh, Zechariah 7 and 11. They said, when it said they, uh, they, uh, stopped their ears, you know, and they pulled, they, uh, pulled away the shoulder. You know, that's talking about you, Jake's, man. You Israelites, man. That's right. All right. Negroes, Latinos, Native Americans. You refuse to hawk eight. Proverbs one, yeah. you know, I yeah. said, yeah, mm -hmm. I, you have said no, uh, all my counsel. All right, what's the counsel of the Lord? The prophets of the Lord teaching this truth, man. Yeah, you know, so that heavy judgment is coming. Yeah, you know, yeah, son. All right, that was it. I got some. Go ahead. You know, we want to cap it off soon. Yeah, people. Uh, uh, do a few more. You probably get yours. You probably get malls and we'll all right, wrap it up. This is uh, Isaiah twenty and one. Mm -hmm. But if you refuse and rebel, ye shall be devoured with the sword. For the mouth of the Lord has spoken it. Mm. That's 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 self-explanatory. You know, 
you shall be devoured by the sword, man. All right, and that sword is gonna come in. It come and make basically the sword is a, is a metaphor for death, man. Yep. All right. Yep. Famine. Yep. Uh, the pestilence is coming. The plagues. The plagues. All right. Natural disasters. Hell, uh, Esau. You know, what's that Psalms? Uh, 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 deliver my soul from the wicked, which is thy sword. Yep. Psalm you know? seventeen. Yep. And then and, and ultimately the missiles, man. Yep. You know, and so that, that's that's self explanatory. All right, that's that's the that's the energy going forth in 2019, man. Judgment, man. Yeah. All right. A lot of you nigga women out here, you want to have some uh, six foot cracker, six foot right. two, six foot three, yellow teeth, cause cause you smoke cigarettes and drink coffee every day, raping the shit out of you. Yeah, we know. We're, 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 Sketches, boots on. <laughs> we're, we're, we're brother said, brother said the big the big Brock Lesnar looking devils with the. The yeah. Buzz cut with the yeah, with the shades with the yeah with the with the string hanging out hanging out the back yeah, man the multicolored lenses yeah you know on utility vest raping the shit out you damn nigga women man all because you want to you know man you look at the so called white man as just this big figure of yeah. how a man supposed to be right well the Lord gonna give you over to the desires of that devil man that's right you know you gonna have like say you know, you know six foot six shirt tucked in you know brown belt with a rattlesnake buckle, okay, boots on with the, with the yeah. spurs, yeah, spurs. whipping on the back, yeah, yeah. You know, and they gonna be having their day way with you, nigga, one in there. That's right. Leaving you in the middle of the street. Yep. Yeah. Like in like in the good old days, man. That's right. And meanwhile, the men of the Lord and the women that the Lord's gonna protect, they they gonna be shielded away. Shielded away. That's right. It's gonna be a free for all of you Negroes out here, especially right. you you uh you top Instagram models, you oh, Instagram man. celebrities, Oprahs. Mm -hmm. Oh man. You yeah. know, uh, you know, you, you know, you yeah, get a little, yeah. little bougie. Yeah. Yeah. You know, the, you know, I don't need a nigga for nothing. Yeah. Independent. Yeah. Man. Independent. Man. man. Most I, you know, <laughs> most I don't fuck you up, man. Most I got something, something up his sleeve for you, man. Yeah. You know, the hey, it, it, that happened in the history. You know, you read the book of Maccabees when, you know, when <clears throat> Antiochus ran down on Jake. Mm -hmm. It said, what? It said the beauty. It said, yeah. Or, it said the beauty of the women changed, man. Yeah. You know, they was all, you know, dog up, they all looking up. They probably was all laying all on the ground. Yeah, laying lay on the ground, look, look, looking, looking through. Yep. That's coming back, man. But it, but 15 times or worse, man. You know? Go ahead. Kind of. I, it's Isaiah 66 and 16. Mm -hmm. For by fire and by his sword will the Lord plead with all flesh, and the slain of the Lord shall be many. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it, it, that, that, that's, coming, that's about to come to pass, man. That Lord's talking about how it shot. All right, it says he's gonna come with his chariots, man. All right, the so-called UFOs, you know, to what render to what the, render his anger with fury, man. Yeah, yeah. You know, <laughs> it says what the strength of the Lord shall be many, man. All right, a, a, a large, a, a large mass amount of people are going to be killed, man. All right, a lot of a lot of numbers going to be made up of women, man, because it's more. They say what? It's more women on earth than men. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. All right, it's, it's less men than women. All right, so a lot of y'all gonna gonna uh, make up a large portion of that 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 slain in that day, man. Why? Because you're proud, you're wicked, you're evil. You know, you're totally out of order. All right, and the spirit of the Lord is not dealing with you, man. So what's gonna happen? You gonna perish. All right, <laughs> go ahead. All right, that was that was that one more time. Yeah, I just okay. that one's uh, First Matthew's one twenty six, man. Uh -huh. Yeah, going into what Rock is always speaking about. Oh yeah, man. it says so that the princes and elders mourned. The virgins and young men were feeble, and the beauty of women was changed. Mm. Every bridegroom took up lamentation, and she that sat in the marriage chamber was in heaviness. Mm. Yeah, so it was, it was a great mourning in Israel, man. Because yeah. the Greeks, the Greeks basically, uh, they basically broke martial law to Jerusalem. Yeah. You know, Antiochus, the, the wicked ass devils, man. Which, 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 they, them devils got to pay for that, all right? Because they, they polluted the temple. Yeah. But the point was. They said, what, the beauty of the women changed, man. Yeah. And uh, the apostles always say, hey, women, like you said, the Instagram models all dolled up, the makeup and the hair and all that. But yeah. y'all gonna be looking finished, man. Oh, yeah. You know, you yeah. gonna have the makeup and the cosmetics. And them demons gonna be heaving over you in that day because they gonna recognize, like, yeah. Oh, yeah, I remember you from Instagram. Man. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah, that's right. And Esau gonna be in full demon mode. Man. That's right. That's and if right. you got any type of connection to demonic activity, that evil spirit gonna attract right to you damn women, man. That's right. And have his way with you, man. That's right. You know? You gonna, man, the Lord is about to really send you, you people out here for, he's gonna alter your whole reality, man. That's right. Everything that you thought was life 
is going to be turned upside down, man. That's right. You know, you're going to be forced to come into the realization that the children of Israel is coming back into power, and you you messed up this go around, man. That's right. So now you're going to have to you're going to have to eat eat what you sow. That's right. You know, you reap what you sow, man. That's right. That's right. You've been out here frolicking around in the world, being careless. Mm -hmm. You know, moving without discretion, mm -hmm. zero class. Mm -hmm. You you know, your you cleanliness is just horrible. You don't clean, you don't cook, you don't clean yourself. Nope. Your, your, your body is just in horrible condition. Mm -hmm. Your scalp is through. You know, pimples, stink, house, house reek of pig feet. You're going to have to pay for all of that, man. You got yeah, to pay right. for all that. Your little kids, you got the little kids running around, snotty noses, bad yes. cursing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You have to pay for that. Yeah, that's right, that's right, man. That's right. Yeah, and the judgment is coming very soon, man. Very soon. F faster than you think, man. You know, it's going to take a lot of women by surprise, man. Mm -hmm. You know, and that, 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 it got Isaiah 4 and 1 is, 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 is coming, approaching uh, 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 speedily, man. You know, a lot of y'all gonna be gonna be severely humbled, all right. You gonna seek out the man, the Lord, man. Yeah, it don't even mean we gonna take him. Yeah, it, I, I, you know, I, just about, I just about to say a lot of y'all gonna get put to death, man. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You know, probably was you know, probably finally fucking my face, man. <laughs> put you to put you to right to death, man. Yeah. You know, and the, and the, and the woman and the, and the woman that's probably not you know maybe not be that attractive, but he, he, it's just solid. It's just a spirit, man. It's a good yeah. spirit. You know. Yeah. Yeah, you're gonna be able to tell. That, that, that's right. Yeah, yeah. Spirit, you know? mm -hmm. That's right. That's right. Mm -hmm. That's right. Yeah. Yeah. You wanna finish off? You got something else? That was it. Huh? Okay. Nah, that was it. That was it. All right. So you know, it's various topics flowing in the spirit. You know, Logan and um, Aki that tune in, uh, edified. Uh, so we're gonna end it there. Give no praise, sign and glory to Yahweh by Hashem. Yahweh Shai by Hashem. Makadosh. The bonds to the apostles, elders, and great millstone, and uh, Logan to the next. Video, Shalom. Shalom. Shalom.